the short-range air defense missile systems can be fired from three platform variants and delivering rapid potent attack capability. These include a shoulder launch for single fire, a lightweight multiple launcher capable of firing three missiles via a tripod, and a self-propelled launcher designed to fire up to eight missiles from a Stormer armored vehicle. The British MOD announced that a £98.4 million contract, supporting 119 jobs, has been extended to maintain short-range air defence for the British Army and Royal Marines. Thales UK won the initial contract in 2018, helping to modernise and develop the missile systems as part of the future air defence availability project. This latest announcement confirms a five-year extension to the contract, sustaining over 100 jobs at Thales UK's Belfast site and within the wider Northern Ireland supply chain, ASD News comments. Northern Ireland Secretary, Brandon Lewis said, Northern Ireland has a proud history as a world leader in defence engineering and innovation. Today's announcement shows again the level of confidence in Northern Ireland is a great place to do business. Defence Minister, Jeremy Quinn said, This contract ensures the vital air defence capabilities, capable of dealing with a multitude of threats, are maintained and readily available to deploy. The £98.4 million investment is the second major contract awarded to Northern Ireland's defence industry in less than three months highlighting Northern Ireland's important contribution to the delivery of our critical defence capabilities. DE and S CEO, Sir Simon Bollam said, our dedicated team at DE&S has worked closely with industry colleagues to ensure this crucial air defence capability remains primed and ready to support the UK armed forces until the end of 2026. Northern Ireland plays an imperative role within UK defence and its supply chain. This is the second multi-million pound defence contract awarded to a Northern Ireland-based industry this year. In January, Spirit Aerosystems in Belfast won a £30 million contract for the UK first uncrewed fighter aircraft supporting over 100 local jobs. The missions of the system are in Frontline Armoured Brigade Defence, Permanent or Semi-Permanent Site Defence and Area Defence against air threats, such as fixed-wing aircraft, attack helicopters, cruise missiles, tactical missiles and saturation attacks with standoff weapons released from aircraft and helicopters.